Uh, I've had a question in Unit 3, Lesson 13. I'm looking at 2b. Uh, so we want to find the third derivative. So when you first look at this, uh, you're going to be saying, OK, this is quotient rule because there's a fraction. What I would recommend is let's not do the quotient rule because it's one of those rules that if I have to, I'll use it. But if I can avoid it, I will. So I'm going to write this one as, an ex uh, as a power function. So using our exponent rules, this is going to become x to the negative 5. Now this becomes a lot simpler. So we want to find our third derivative. So the first derivative will be negative 5x to the negative 6. The second derivative will be 30x to the negative 7. And my third derivative will be negative 210x to the negative 8. So there is my third derivative. And you can see if you tried to do this with quotient rule, uh, it's going to be a lot messier and uglier than that. So if you can avoid the quotient rule and write it in like this form, it makes your life a lot easier. If you have any questions, let me know.